that what he has really done subtly, in which Dr. Smith really teases out for us, is to understand that the characters are not just characters in a book, they're not just people we fall in love with, they're not just people that we invest in, but that they are lessons each individually in and of themselves, so that as we follow them down the path, we begin to discover those elements within our own character. What are the fundamental things that we think that we lack or are missing, but are really unbeknownst to us, or perhaps undiscovered by us yet, still there? I. I read the um, Wizard of Oz books, the Oz books, um, with my son when he was four, and we read all of them as well, and he fell in love with the characters, and then I showed him the movie, and we watched the movie every year, partly because of our love of Oz, but partly because it was part of our family ritual, and I want to, him to have that experience as well. And so when Dr. Smith shared his book with me, I actually shared sections of it with Luca. And at age six, he caught on to a number of those things and I think that what's important about Dr. Smith's book is that it highlights for us, it reinforces for us, it reminds us of the importance of childhood, the importance of youth, the importance of education, the importance of reading, and the importance that it is an individual discovery. That each of us, at different moments in our lives, pick up different things from this book. We respond to it in different ways. And what Dr. Smith has done is to allow us to be carried away to Oz, but to find our way back to Kansas. There's a reason why there's a musical on Broadway, which is you know one of the number one musicals where we're still talking about it. There's another series of books beyond Oz that other people have carried on, because for us, um, the story of the Scarecrow, the Lion, the Tin Man, and Dorothy didn't end there. There are still myriad characters, there's still myriad possibilities, and there's still other lands of Oz, other emerald cities for us to discover, and I think that that's what Dr. Smith reminds us of.